Welcome back. It is Friday. Thank goodness. That means it's time for your weekly Can't Miss List. That is right. We are going to talk about all the movies and shows you need to be seeing this weekend. And joining us now uh, is television host and pop culture expert Andrew Freund. Andrew, good to have you with us. Hey, all right, so we're going to start off with something called Housekeeping for Beginners. <laughs> and it's a foreign film that's already had a limited release. Yes. Tell us about this. Yeah. Right? It gets posted. All right. Okay, Andrew, that does thank sound you funny. so much. We'll check that out. All right. Thanks, that's going to do it for this Great. hour of Morning News Now. The news continues right now. Stay with us. Thank you. And by the way, we happy want to birthday, happy Jennifer. birthday, Jennifer! Yes. Our senior producer, Jennifer Wiggins White. It Aww. is her birthday today. We love her. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Jennifer. Hope all your wishes come true. And happy Friday. We're so happy you could be with us. I'm Vicki Wynn. So happy to be with you. I'm Morgan Radford, and NBC News Daily starts right now. Today is Friday, April 12th. VP visit Vice President Kamala Harris heading to Tucson in the wake of Arizona's controversial abortion ruling. How the state has become a major focus in the national conversation on reproductive rights. Turning himself in, Kansas City Chiefs player Rishi Rice surrendered to police after he was charged with eight felonies, including aggravated assault. What police are saying about his role in a high-speed car crash in Texas. Dangerous activity Meta announced it is testing new tools to prevent sexual exploitation online. NBC News speaks exclusively with the company's global head of safety. Man's best friend. Training dogs can be difficult, especially for ones who are prone to barking, jumping, or even aggressive behavior. So we're going to get some pro tips from the ultimate dog whisperer, and we're going to meet his own furry friend. I'm so looking forward to talking to Cesar Milan, I can't tell you. He's wonderful. Yeah. Welcome to NBC News Daily. We're going to start in Arizona, where in less than an hour, Vice President Kamala Harris will be landing for a campaign stop. Now, this trip comes just days after the state's Supreme Court ruled that a near total abortion ban from the year 18 1964 is now enforceable. Now, once Harris touches down, she's expected to deliver a stump speech, slamming former President Donald Trump for his record and his rhetoric on abortion. She'll be joined by supporters of reproductive rights from across that state. NBC News correspondent Dana Griffin joins us right now from Tucson, Arizona. Uh, Dana, the campaign has released some excerpts from Vice President's speech. What do we expect her to say? Yeah, Morgan, good morning to you. We expect